Hey guys, it's Takisa and um I am officially 24. I'm officially 24. Um I am on my way to Oh, I got a tattoo today. I got lashes, you know, makeup life. Um I got that done today by Lost Lost Wag Flu. Um he's in Tampa. He does an amazing job. It literally took like 15 minutes to do this. Um and he's super super hospitable and his his customer service is a one definitely go see him that's my boy now i gotta go go back um very soon and this didn't even hurt like for my first tattoo like this didn't hurt at all i'm i'm pretty swollen you can see how it's wept up but um yeah i'm excited i'm about to go get my nails and my feet done right now at my nail salon and um yeah like today is my dinner so oh today is my dinner so we're going um to cooper's hop uh winery and i'm excited because it's my first time going um hopefully we have something to do afterwards but if not then that's fine i have my dress already i gotta find my shoes i gotta find a couple of things so um I'm gonna take y'all with me to go get my stuff done. My toes are already done, my nails are not done, but I think I am gonna get my toes redone because they starting to chip a bit. And I think I'm gonna polish, oh no, they chip now. I ain't see that. Um, but I'm gonna go get a color change. Um, I'm probably gonna do nudes. I wanna get into nudes. I really haven't found a nude that I like, um, but I have to do it and I wanna do it. And it's gonna be for my dress too. My dress is really, really cute, and I'm excited. So, yeah, um, I'm about to turn into the nail salon now, so I'll see you guys when I get finished in there. So, I just left the nail salon, and I'm, I'm highly upset because if you were overbooked or you had appointments, then don't try to sit people down because they're going to pay, like make sure you have coverage she's the the owner or whatever the one that i was waiting to get my nails done by she's like doing five people at one time like girl you can't do that and then i was sitting my, i done finished my pedicure the girl uh the move to another pedicure and i'm waiting to get my nails done and she's sitting people down that had just walked in um and they're getting their nails done and I'm just waiting for a pedicure like that's it I mean I'm waiting for my nails to get done so now I just gotta find me another nail salon I just I mean that's my people that I go to like normally and I usually just don't take I don't make an appointment because they allow walk-in so like she didn't have enough people on her on her uh schedule today because baby she was um busy I was mad. I was trying to get upset. I just paid for my pedicure and just left. Like, I just like, whatever. But I'm actually very tired. I'm hungry. So I'm about to go get me some food. Probably some firehouse wings. And I, if you're from Tampa, then you know you got to call ahead of time when you get in firehouse to make sure that your food done. And you got to call two more times before you even pull up to make sure the food is done. Because they'll say, oh, it'll be done in 10, 15 minutes. Then you get there. You wait another extra 20 minutes to get your food. Like, nah. So, I'm on the other side of town. So, I'm probably just going to call in my order. And by the time I get there, my food will be done. Because it'll take me like 20 minutes to get there. So, um, yeah. The, the only other thing that I need to do is... Um, I don't even know what I need to do. I'm tired, y'all. Oh, I need to go home and do my hair. Um, My friend said he wants my hair to be out for my birthday. But it's my birthday. So I'm going to do what I want to do. Um, The people that I was getting my wig from didn't have the wig that I wanted in stock. So I have to wear one of my wigs. Which is fine. It's cool. But I wanted to, to wear a new wig. Because it's my birthday, you know, and I just wanted a new wig. But 
that's saving me money, which is fine. I'm pretty upset because I wanted to do that. You know what? I'm about to go to Mr. and Mrs. Krabs and eat by myself at the bar. That's what I'm about to do. I'm about to go get me some crabs. I need to go home and get my AirPods first because it's just going to be me. I'm, I need to go. Yeah, I need to go sit down and have peace. So I got to go get my headphones or my AirPods. Um, yes. Yes. Ooh, yes. I wanted crabs all day today. So, yep. Um, I'll see you guys when I get to where I'm going. I don't think I'm going to go to Mr. Mr. Sky. I need to find another place to get crabs from. Because I've been eating them too much. But it crabs bless. I don't care. If I don't find a place that I want to go to that has crabs that I know is good, then I'm going to um, just go there. Because, yeah. Y'all, I really wanted my nails done. Like, I'm just going to go to my regular place my old people that I used to go to um, by my mom's house and get my nails done because oh my gosh, that just pissed me off anyway so, yeah, I see y'all when I'm gonna go get my food alright y'all, so I ended up not getting crabs I went to B's Island Kitchen in Tampa, you know about B's Island Kitchen that you know that you know um, but nah, Beast Island Kitchen is a Jamaican um, spot. It's Caribbean food, oxtail, curry, goat, uh, curry chicken, jerk chicken, brown stew, all the above, all the above. And it's slap. I'm telling you, it's so good. Like, the cornbread, fire. Chicken, fire. Macaroni and cheese, fire. Everything, fire. Just everything. And now I'm going to the hair store right next door. And I don't know what I need to get yet, but I do need to pick up some lashes. And the hair store has the best lashes. It's like big lashes. Like, I need to be seen. So, I'm going to give me some lashes and see what else they got here. As far as hair, because I don't know what I'm going to do yet. So, yeah. I'll show y'all when I, what I got when I get home and what I got from Marshalls. Because I got some stuff from Marshalls, too. And y'all, the steals that I got, oh my gosh, like, y'all gonna be shocked when I show y'all what I got. But, um, I'll see y'all when I get to the house. Okay, so I'm home now. I live three flights up because I don't know that that was the only apartment available. But, that, those stairs are death every time. Never fails. Okay, so. Now is the time where I show you guys what I got from the store. Okay, so first we're gonna do Marshalls. So I bought myself a shower caddy. I needed one. So yeah. And it goes with my bathroom, my back, my black and my rose gold. And it is like a charcoal black. It's not really a black black. Now for the steals, I'm going to show you guys. Hold on one second. This is total steal. And I didn't spend more than $50. So, as you guys see, the Hyper Real Glow Palette in the rose gold one from MAC, $10. This, you guys, I, I work at MAC. This is like $36. I got this for $10. Urban Decay Naked Skin Shape Shifter, which is like a contour palette, $10. It comes with a color corrector. It comes with uh, color correctors and highlighter shades and contour shades, cream and powder. So, and they had an open one. So I got to open it and swatch it and it's definitely darker than me. So I picked this up too. This is $10. I am beyond excited and stoked to try this i'm gonna try this on my skin tonight um to see how it goes and last but not least you guys are gonna flip when you see this this palette just came out not too long ago and for me to be able to get my hands on this at this amazing price blew my mind and it was the last one 
This is the Alyssa Edwards Anastasia Beverly Hills palette. Y'all, this palette is like $50. Their palette collections like or like collaborations are always $50. This is a $50 palette and I got it for $19.99. They say compare at $27. This is not $27. This is $50. I work in Macy's at the mat counter and they have an impulse which is like kind of a small Sephora kind of thing or whatever and they have Anastasia and this palette is like $50 I'm telling you guys it's $49 at the counter I'm gonna open it and show you guys how it looks and I just got the Amorizi palette my best friend bought it for me but this is untouched brand spanking new look at this i am so excited look at that yellow and i swatched this palette and i actually use this palette at work this is a beautiful palette look at the blues look how vibrant that is look how vibrant that purple is oh my gosh and it even has blacks and then it comes with a brush the brush kind of fell over when i opened it but y'all for me to get this for twenty dollars is like a joke. Anyways, um, like I was saying, um, that was that's like a steal. Like for me to spend twenty forty dollars on name brand stuff from Marshalls, and they're not like cheap. They're not the like. What's that? The W7 and like Profusion is up up there now because they getting themselves together. But you know, like this stuff is like in the mall, in the Sephora's, in Mac. Like, oh my gosh. Anyways, um, the next things that I got were from the hair store. I picked up the these lashes here from um response so i don't know this brand but they have some nice lashes i've tried these lashes before and these are super nice and i picked up some mink lashes by magic the magic collection they're called the mystic lash and these are full i'm gonna wear these tonight so you guys can see how they look on me they look good in person like they match my lashes on my arm um and then i picked up some brown pencils to go in my kit. I, I'm only going to put two in my kit and then I'm going to use the other one on me. These type of pencils are really good for brows. Like if you're doing other people's brows too. Um, the cheaper the brow, the better. The cheaper the pencil, the better it is. Um, I learned that from Angel Cumberbatch. If you guys know who that is, then yes. She's a Trini um, makeup artist and she is well known. Um, this is the pencils that you want to use and then they don't come with spoolies or sharpeners but um if you have you should have a sharpener in your kit and you should have spoolies and then i also got uh wig caps for tonight i'm gonna braid my hair down and then get dressed i don't think i'm gonna show you guys me until i actually get ready um because this is already a long vlog i don't want it to be longer than 30 minutes um but if you haven't already follow me on instagram follow me on snapchat follow me on um what else twitter i'll be posting myself and how i look and all that stuff tonight on um on twitter and on instagram and snapchat of course but i want to show you guys what i got to eat it's so good so, if you're from the Caribbean, then you know about oxtails. I'm pretty sure a lot of people know what oxtails are, but the Caribbean style oxtails. Oh, this food is going to be so fire. I just, oh, I can't wait. I haven't had it in so long. Look at this plate. Look at this plate. The macaroni and cheese I haven't had in a while. But I know when I was a little girl, their mac and cheese was bomb. 
I already ate the cornbread, did the stem chance. Um, the oxtails, this is a large plate, and this was like $13. And the guy, you know y'all men, Caribbean men, they like to, um, actually, let me set this up so I can eat, because I'm tired of talking and standing, I'm ready to eat. Um, they like to, oh, I'm showing you the apartment. They like to stare and like, if they think you're cute, they're gonna give you stuff. So they gave me extra oxtail, extra oxtail gravy. <laughs> this is so good. Let's try the macaroni and cheese. I haven't had the macaroni and cheese in a while. I know how the oxtails and stuff taste because they it's the same man from when I was a little girl. It's not bad. It's not how it used to be when I was little. But I got me some sour ale too. If you don't know what sour ale is, um, I'll put it on the screen so you can search up how uh, what it is. People call it sour ale, sour ale. I call it sour ale. That's what my grandparents call it. And yeah, I'm about to eat. Y'all, I think I'm going to just end the vlog right here. Because I might end up taking a nap. I need to take a nap because I don't know if I'm going out tonight. But thank you guys for watching. Make sure you subscribe. And I'll see you in my next video. Bye.